and welcome to Ta Hero. Today, we're going to talk about how to get your blog post noticed and increase your readership with the help of the widely popular Shareaholic plugin. First and foremost, what is Shareaholic? Shareaholic prides itself on being an all-in-one content amplification platform. Basically, Shareaholic is designed to help you increase your reach and engage your audience, and it comes with a great list of features to achieve just that. First, the Shareaholic plugin comes with the social media buttons that make it easier for your readers to share your posts and articles. With just one click, your audience will be able to post your content, including images and video on Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, and more. This is a great way to get your post out there and also a great way to get new visitors to your site. Not only that, this buttons comes in three different and very good looking formats, so you can simply pick the one that best fits your site's aesthetics. Secondly, Shareholic has a related content feature that highlights relevant content across your website. This is a great way to increase engagement and ensure that visitors stay in your site longer like buttons, this also comes in several themes, so you can just choose one that fits your site. Best of all, you get full editorial control at all times, so you can pretty much pick and choose which content you want highlighted. Lastly, Shareaholic comes with its own analytics dashboard. This gives you valuable insights on how your content is performing in terms of sharing and engagement. With Shareaholic Analytics, you'll be able to find your most influential sharers, determine your most popular content, know which social networks are referring the most visitors to your site, and other such parameters. So indeed, if you are serious about increasing your page views and visitor engagement, as well as improving the overall user experience for your website or blog, the Shareaholic plugin is a plugin to install. So now that we know what makes Shareaholic so special, let's put it in our website. Let's get started. From your WordPress dashboard, let's go to the plugins menu and click on Add New. Put in a search for Shareaholic. Go ahead and install the plugin, then activate it. Now, after you've activated the plugin, you should be able to see a Shareaholic menu item on your WordPress sidebar. Go ahead and click on that. It will take you to the Shareaholic welcome screen where it details all the great things that Shareaholic can do for your website. Let's click on Get Started. You are now on the Shareaholic app manager. As you can see, there are three sections that you can customize. Let's go through each one. First, we have the related and promoted content. Here, you can choose where you want your related content to show up. You can check whether you want it after each post, each page, or even on your index and category pages. So just check which ones work for you. For this tutorial, let's just put a check on post, though you can actually choose as many as you want. You can customize it further by clicking on Customize. This is where you can choose a headline for your related content section as well as the theme you want to use and the number of items you want it to show. It even has a nifty preview feature so you can see what it looks like. When you're done, just make sure to save your settings. Now, as I mentioned before, you get full editorial control of the related content that you want to display. You can also display promoted content, which could help you earn a bit of money. Still on the Related and Promoted Content section, you can do all these by clicking on Edit Related and Promoted Content Settings. Next, we have the Share Buttons section. This is where you can control the look and feel of the buttons that allow your readers to share your content to social media sites. Just like in the Related Content section, you can choose which pages you want your buttons to show up on. Again, for this tutorial, Let's just choose Post. You also have the option to choose whether you want the buttons to show up above your content or below. 
You can then click Customize for more options. Here, you can choose a theme and a cute headline. You also get other options like position, size, alignment, etc. You can add more icons right here by just clicking on the social media network that you want to include. You can also remove icons by just hovering over it and clicking on the X. Again, save settings when you're done. You can also click on Edit Share Button Settings at the bottom of this section for more customization options. Here you can choose the format of the message, which URL shortener service to use, and a whole lot more. Lastly, we have the monetization section. If this is something that you're interested in, this is where you can control the degree of monetization that the plugin will engage in. With all of that finished, make sure to click Save Changes at the bottom of the page. Now, if you want to get access to Shareaholic's social analytics, you will need to sign up for a Shareaholic account. You can do so by clicking on Configure Additional Features at the right-hand side of the screen. This will take you to the Shareaholic website where you can sign up for a Shareaholic account. Click on Create New Account at the bottom. Then just type in your email address and a password, then sign up. It will then ask you to link your website to your Shareaholic account. Just click Link Now. You also have the option to skip this step if you wish. It will then take you to your settings page so just go over the information there real quick. You can then click Verify Website. Once that's done, it will give you a site verified message. You can then save settings. You will then see your site name with a green check mark beside it. That pretty much means that Shareaholic is already starting to track your website activity. If you want to see your site's performance, just click on Insights. Now, you probably won't see anything there yet because it will take up to 24 hours for Shareaholic to generate your first analytics report. So just check back from time to time. So that's it. It's that easy. So this concludes our tutorial on installing and using the Shareaholic plugin. All you have to do now is sit tight and enjoy the onslaught of new visitors and increased page views. Till next time.